the memory of an elephant. Are you a bit of a salty dog? Well then maybe you would like to remember the mane. to the Vernon's YouTube channel. Today we're going to be making the Remember the Maine. This is going to be a little meeting of the minds of a Manhattan and a Sazerac. So you're going to have the rich herbaceous layer of the absinthe right up front right when it hits you in the nose. We're going to have a nice little full-bodied rye. We're going to have a delicious but not overpowering sweet vermouth and we're going to have just the right amount of cherry herring. Charles Baker is responsible for the recipe that we have for this today from the Gentleman's Companion back in 1933. So the Remember the Main refers to the sinking of the vessel of the same name in the Havana Harbor that kind of helped start the Spanish-American War off. But we're not going to be battling anything but a hangover after we enjoy this, or maybe a few of them. So we're going to start off with two ounces of our rye. Three quarters ounce of our sweet vermouth. And we've got to get exact with this one because too much will overpower it and too little you won't even know what's happening. Two teaspoons of the cherry herring. With the freezer chilled glass, you'll be able to just perfectly coat the inside with the absinthe before pouring. garnish it with an orange peel and we're going to zest it just a bit. A history lesson never tasted so good. That is fucking delicious. Nice and herbal. On the nose you get the aroma of the, the star anise from the absinthe. You get a little bit of the citrus from the orange peel. You can get the little punch of cherry and then it completely smooths out into sweet vermouth and the rye whiskey gives you just a little bitterness on the back end. It's it's a treat. It is a treat. Thank you for joining us today at the Vernon's YouTube channel. Be sure to follow and subscribe and don't forget to click below to reserve today and come in and try one of these seaworthy cocktails yourself. Cheers. Go drink this in the back. <laughs>